Hi friends, we will see the byte stream in Java. Now byte stream is used to perform input and output of one byte at a time. So there are many classes which supports byte stream operations, but commonly used classes are file input stream and file output stream. So file input stream means the source of the input is file. So you are using the object of this class to read the file. File output stream means the destination onto which I want to write the data is file. So if I want to perform write operation onto the file, then I will make use of object of file output stream. So one code is shown here, where, are, where there are two references, in is one and out is other reference, respectively of classes file input stream and file output stream. So I have initialized in the reference to some file input stream input.txt that means now I will read from the text file input.txt and an out reference is initialized to other text file which is output.txt. So in this loop I am reading one character from input.txt and I am writing it into the output.txt. So this basically this program will perform operation of copying input.txt into output.txt. We will implement this example practically. Now this is demonstration for byte stream where I am reading from one file which is input.txt and I am writing into other file which is output.txt. I am reading one character from input.txt using this method in.read and I am writing it to other file using write method. For that first I should have input.txt on D drive. So I will create that file first. So here suppose onto the D drive I create one text file with name input and in that text file I write something say this is byte stream test. I save it and close it. Now only input.txt is there in D drive. I come to the program and now I run the program. So message is printed which is file is copied. So I will again go to the D drive and I will check whether output.txt is created. Yes, it is there. If I open it, the contents are copied. So this is how you will handle byte stream.